<laughs> um, it's going to be hot in Hewitt today. We're going to be up around 90, and there's going to be another threat for some thunderstorms today, you guys. Central Western Massachusetts uh, had the highest risk of picking up a thunderstorm today, and a couple of them could be on the stronger side. Again, tomorrow we'll have a risk for some storms, hit or miss. Not raining the entire day, but for that reason, Sunday's the pick of the weekend. The humidity hangs around through tomorrow, too. Less humid. Finally, we get a little break, a little relief in this oppressive air mass that's been in place for the second half of the weekend. High temp uh, temperatures right now, I should say, are in the lower 70s, and the dew points have dropped a little bit north and west of Boston. It's still muggy, but it's not quite as sticky as we've been the past few mornings at this time. Satellite and radar quiet. There's a little bit of fog out there, and it's locally thick, so the fog is going to burn off by late morning for most of us. What we're waiting on is this front back to the west that brought some thunderstorms in upstate New York overnight. Now there's some showers from Burlington, Vermont, stretching back down to Pennsylvania. As this front comes in with the daytime heating and the humidity in place, that'll be the trigger for some thunderstorms develop this afternoon. So don't focus on the exact placement, but the overall theme. Do you notice where most of the storms are focused? Outside of 495, particularly in western New England, some nasty storms from far western New Hampshire into southern Vermont and the Berkshires here by mid to uh, late afternoon. By 4 to 6 p.m., a lot of these will be weakening. Central Mass may still have a few stronger storms. Hail, as well as damaging wind gusts, heavy rain, obviously, and lightning are the biggest threats in any thunderstorms that develop today. Upper 80s to low 90s for high temperatures. We're keeping an eye to the western horizon, especially in Worcester County Points West. We'll be in the low 80s on Cape Cod. Low clouds, fog, muggy tonight, dropping back into the low 70s. Here's the timing of our Saturday. I do think there'll be a lot of cloud cover tomorrow. There will be some breaks of sun here or there. Warm and humid again. Could be a shower in the morning. And really, the threat for a downpour starts early, like midday through the afternoon. Not raining the whole day, but they'll be kind of hit or miss and spotty in nature right on through the evening hours when we could see some heavy downpours and a brief thunderstorm until about sunset. And then things will dwindle after that. Here's a map on Sunday morning. Sun's out. Looks beautiful. There'll be some clouds and mix in with the sunshine on Sunday afternoon, but it will be a dry day and the humidity will drop. You'll feel the difference. Highs tomorrow, not as hot as today. We'll top out in the 80s for many of us tomorrow because of the cloud cover that's in the place and the threat for thunderstorms. Mid to upper 80s would so actually may be a little bit warmer on Sunday, but less humid. So a pleasant day overall. Nice second half of the weekend here. Start of next week will be in the mid-80s, upper 80s on Tuesday, and the humidity starts to creep back up a little bit as well. We'll be in the mid to upper 80s through the middle part of next week with the threat for some thunderstorms returning for Wednesday and Thursday. Brianna? Danielle?